going on guys, it's Beast here today, I'm going to show you another HTML tutorial and uh, more like a uh, web design tutorial, this is uh, more a CSS part of the web design and uh, here you can see an uh, image displayed in a little box with shadows around it and if I hover, hover over it, it will uh, like display a button over it and uh, you can display anything over it, it doesn't really matter but uh, as you can see it uh, drops the opacity uh, down and puts like a little grey overlay over it but you can still see the image so yeah let's uh, jump into the code view and see what this is about so I have a div with a main body I mean main so it's like basically everything containing that you don't really need that but you can use that the really important thing is this uh, div and class with content and uh, here we'll have the button I use an uh, anchor tag in front of the button but you can use on location uh, in the button tag in, in the button tag not uh, not an a tag around the button tag so basically it's just uh, if I hover over it and click on it it will take me to the website and as you can see this is the fish I don't even care what is it you can do whatever you want with the image and you know uh, you don't even need to uh, you don't even need uh, the like hyperlink in it you can just display like a text over it and say like a short description of it or whatever so as you can see here I have the image and everything but that's not the main thing the main thing is this uh, whole thing like the CSS part of it you can see this is the main but this uh, I mean it's uh, you should you should use like uh, this main div so it should be like div and then inside of the div there is another div so inside the main there is a content and uh, yeah so <clears throat> how I really did this is uh, I'll open up a new new document so that's the best thing to do and uh, so what you will need is uh, I will not open it this one, uh, I'll just use notepad instead of it. Uh, you just have to type in uh, basically, uh, I said basically a lot, but give a div with a class and uh, with main, of course. But now you can close the div. And uh, probably uh, it's best uh, if I just give you the source code and not type it up. But I want you to see, like, I don't know if you see it, the whole thing, but uh, you will have the, like, the whole thing, the whole source code of it in on my website. So, and you will have a link to that uh, as well. So, I know it's a short tutorial, and uh, I don't really want to type it up and everything, but if you really need it then uh, you can just check it out on my website and uh, you can copy and paste it but I will just explain uh, what you need I mean what is really important so this is uh, basically just giving this whole thing and this and this is just the, the box around it so uh, it's in the box so then the overflow hidden is really important so that's why it's uh, it's not showing right here because if I delete over, uh, overflow like here As you can see it's under here it will still go upwards and everything but it will it will really mess up so just, uh, just put overflow hidden in there so then uh, you have to put uh, main and then hover and then content so inside the main div when you hover over the content they will uh, it will do a transform and translate on the y-axis for 245 pixels so why is 245 pixels because you want 5 pixels more as your width so you can give like a thousand pixel width for your uh, box and the uh, image and then have a negative uh, 1005 so uh, you get the point of it then you don't really need this but I mean you, you need this so yeah you need this one you don't need this one that's what I wanted to say uh, here 
uh, transition and transform in, in uh, 300 milliseconds. This is basically the transition that you can see right here. You know, this is 300 milliseconds. It's uh, 0 0.3 seconds. So, yeah. Then go down uh, here. You can adjust like the color of the thing. I mean, the overlay that you see on it. Originally, it was uh, well blue for me, but I thought that gray would be better. So if I change the opacity to like I don't know, 0.9, and reload it, you will not see that much difference, but it will be less opaque. So. Just keep in mind, and I will change this one too, but I will explain that in a second. So, this is this part of it on the content is the same as this one, so you just copy and paste it. You don't need to write the whole thing on the button because I use a button, but you can use whatever you want. So, if you want to use a paragraph tag, I don't care. <coughs> uh, I have a width on it with 100%. And the height of 50, 50 pixels, uh, margin top, background is black, so you can see it's black until I hover over it. But yeah, oops, and then we have border zero. You don't really need it, but I mean, it's sure good if, if it's there. Uh, cursor is pointer. You don't need that either because uh, if it's a button, it's obviously it will be a pointer. Uh, but I just put those in so in color white is the text on it, over it this is the font I use the 16 pixels and it's Tahoma uh, it's uh, on every windows and I don't know the Mac part of it but you don't really need to you, you don't need a font to make it like make it work uh, the button ho hover is uh, when you hover over the button it's a uh, basic thing basic CSS and uh, yeah I think that's all I have for today guys and uh, I hope this tutorial help you and because uh, I made this tutorial because I, I didn't find anything uh, on YouTube about this and this is a really good thing because if you go to like uh, Optic TV and uh, they are really really big thing and as you can see if you hover over it they have this and it's a really big thing with having the CSS in it and it's really easy to do and that's why I thought yeah why not show with the public and uh, it was a good idea so yeah thank you guys so much for watching I was Beast and hope you guys did something useful I'm out peace thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you enjoyed like comment and subscribe and if you want to get partner check the description for other infos alright bye